with Chloe and the Nerve. Looking for a learning adventure. Okay, good luck. Hope you find a good one. Oh, I already have. Tell me, Nerb, what do you know about the urinary system? Way too much. <laughs> no, seriously, what do you know? Uh, there's some bean-shaped things and maybe some tubes? Precisely, and also imprecisely. You see, the urinary tract begins at the kidneys, which are the two bean-shaped things. The kidneys are organs the size of your fist that sit under your ribs along your back. Kidneys filter blood to remove waste. That waste and extra water combine to make urine, which is also called pee. Um, Chloe? After the kidneys, it's pretty much just plumbing. The urine enters two small tubes, one coming from each kidney. Chloe? Those are called the ureters. They lead to the bladder. The bladder is a sac that holds the pee. Chloe! Right now, your bladder is probably feeling very full, since you look really stressed out about it. When it's time to go to the bathroom, the smooth muscle of the bladder contracts to push pee into another tube called the urethra, which carries the pee out of the body. Chloe, you know that typically I'd love to learn anything, anything about the human body. But right now, right now, I think I'd really prefer to talk about anything, anything. Oh, I'm sorry, Nerb. I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. <laughs> it's just that staying hydrated is incredibly important to keep the human body running well. Fluids of all kinds help keep us hydrated, but nothing does it as well as water. Oh, yes. Tell me more about water, Chloe. Our bodies are actually made of water. 60% of our body mass is just water. Have another sip, Chloe. Talk to me about hydration. We feel better and even think better when we drink enough water. Plus, it's delicious and refreshing. Drinking water keeps you from getting dehydrated. That's when you don't drink enough water and you feel dizzy and sick. How is that water? Chloe? It's great. I feel very hydrated. Did you know that you can tell if you've drunk enough water by the color of your pee? If you're well hydrated, your pee will be light yellow because your body has plenty of extra water to get rid of. If you're dehydrated, your pee may be a darker yellow because your body is holding on to the water instead of peeing it out. Have you had enough water, Chloe? And now, we wait. Ah! I have to pee! Get in line, sister. It's gonna be a wait. Wait, I can't wait. I just drank this whole bottle of water. What could possibly be going on in there? Just take a deep breath and think of all those happily hydrated cells sloshing around in your body full of all that water you just drank. Grandpa Chubba die on nerve? Yeah? Who's that? I'm, I'm trying to nap here. Nap? I've been waiting all this time, and you've been napping? It's the only place to grab some peace and quiet around here. Excuse me, Grandpa Nerve, but do you think you could let us pee? Yeah, yeah. Keep your pants on. You know what they say, ladies first. Oh no, that's what humans say. In nervous, the saying goes up, he who shows up first to urinate 
is allowed to be the first to urinate. <laughs> oh, come on. You just made that up. No.